start with the latest cooperation between the two Koreas. Officials from the two sides have agreed to start joint checkups on parts of the railroads located within North Korea and those that cross the inter Korean land border. Our Unification Ministry correspondent, Oh Jong Hee, starts us off. The two Koreas will form a joint investigation team and get down to checking the status of North Korean and inter-Korean railroads next month. This as agreed at Tuesday's inter-Korean talks on connecting and modernizing railways between the two Koreas. There are two railway lines the two Koreas are hoping to work on. The Kyongin line that links Seoul and North Korean city of Shinriju and the Dongen line along the eastern coast of the peninsula. From July 24th, Seoul and Pyongyang will start a joint investigation on parts of these rail lines in North Korea first. The two Koreas also hope to jointly check parts of the railways that cut through the inter-Korean border starting from mid-July. The delegations say they've agreed to connect and modernize the Gyeonggi and Donghae lines at a high level and agreed to arrange practical measures for design and construction. However, concerns remain on these railway projects as South Korean resources and equipment will have to go into North Korea for construction, which may violate international sanctions on North Korea. But the South Korean delegation said, Most of our work is preparing and checking up to begin our projects when the conditions are met, so I think there are none that will violate international sanctions. The two Koreas agreed to communicate further through their contact channel to settle on the detailed schedules on preparations for the joint investigation next month. Oh Jong-hee, Arirang News.